Oh guys, another video. No, not the work top, all that horrible rust stain, all that brush, all them two screws, them, them two screws do hold a bit of a clue to what we're looking at today. Finally guys, I've got my hands on one. Now I weren't even expecting this, so I weren't going to buy one just yet, I wanted to get some info on how to use these things. So I think we need to start it up. Uh, it's going to have no input at the minute because the only cable I've got looks like the original. I like that, that's pretty cool. Is that an adjuster screw? Is that got a little variable resistor in there or something? I don't know. Nice little crock clip, but uh, it needs replacing. Hey yeah, guys, helping her, I can't say who, someone to move house last night. And he brings this out and says, Do you want this? Oh, how yes, thank you very much. Let's power it up. I am still figuring out these as you do this is my first ever one so I'm chuffed to bits man <coughs> I'm guessing that's your uh, well, what's that channel ah, channel 1, channel 2 cool AC Run DC, loads of channel modes there, same again. Position, I know for a fact that changes what position you want it on the CRT. It's a CRT, loving it. And yeah, guys, there's, there's all sorts, man. I just can't wait to get stuck into it. But guys, what I want to do today is show you inside it. Now, I've already taken the screws out. We're just going to turn that off. Spin it around. Let's have a look. I've got no idea what age this is. Uh, I do know the person I had it off, his dad, uh, when they moved from the UK to New Zealand. They took it with them, and that was back in the early 80s. About 82 when I was born. Wicked. So let's have a little look. Oh mate, it's just perfect. There's literally no dust in it, absolutely nothing. It's been so well looked after. Nice big input transformer there, variable transformer that. So yeah, different modes on it, and there you go. There is a. There's the plate. Show your input. Uh, got a rough idea what that panel is, but I'll get back to that in a minute. That is a beautiful CRT, just reminds me of one out of a rear projection TV. My camera won't focus, there we go. Beautiful, love that deflection coil. So simple, just <laughs> that's brilliant. I love it. And of course, you got your uh. Like what you call electron gun all sealed in there so I think what you really want to see is this thing fired up and that tube glowing so can we actually see it glowing I don't think we can let's turn this light off just about yeah, I can just about see some glowing in there. <coughs> oh, look at that. Oh, some of them. I hope not. Sorry, guys, I could smell some burning then. Let me pause that. No, guys, nothing burning. Just some of must have come in. See that or it's in stereo. <laughs> Oh, ooh, I don't want to take this apart, guys. I really don't want to take it apart at all. I just want to leave it exactly as it is, untouched. You've got all your parts there, your selectors, you know what I mean? It's there, man. Come on, focus, you stupid thing. Thank you. That's a work of art, man. Very well made. 
would like to see a bit more cable management. All right. It's a little bit messy there, but yeah, it's well made. Yeah, apparently 80s, this thing. Something like that. It's absolutely mint. Ah, oh, look. <laughs> is that what I think it is? It is, isn't it? Is that the flyback? There's the flyback underneath. Oh, I think the flyback might be underneath, guys. Do I see a cable down there? Mm -hmm. I think we need to pause this and uh, turn it upside down, have a look underneath, see if we can find the flyback. Well, there we go. That is the underside of it. It does look really pretty. Here's the daft thing, guys. On this uh, CRT, I'm not seeing a high voltage cup going onto the, uh, the tube. Unless it sits somewhere at the front, but I can't see that. It's an interesting CRT, that. Let's turn it over. Oh, God, be careful. Please don't fall over. The high voltage has got to go in somewhere. Hmm. Well, it does kick out high voltage because, well, there it is. So that high voltage simply has to go through the back of it. It's got to. I've never seen one like it. Mm. I like it, guys. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. And, uh, I will start having a play with this when I get to figure out how to use it. So be safe, another video coming up soon, hopefully the weekend, uh, yeah, it's going to go bang, well, bang, fizz, sparks, Arkoi anyone, yes, great, thank you very much, have some of that, see you soon.